Hello and welcome back to Brett's Play on XCOM Enemy Within. I totally forgot the title of the game there for a second. Where last time left off, we were still doing alright. I believe, was it last time? Was it the episode before that? I can't quite remember. But either way, recently we lost our second character. I think it may have been last episode. It's been a few days since I recorded. Uh, and that was uh, Michaela Pilkington. Only two kills and four missions though, so... <laughs> Not really missing a whole lot, are we? Um, killed by the same weapon, but a different enemy, a fin man instead of a floater. So there you go. Um, only a squad though, to be fair. We do have a new assault, Lolo Deckers, at least, which is something. Um, I probably should hire a few more people. We only got two more people remaining. I do have a few more names. Uh, oh, right, I, I also should mention, yeah, so I have a few more names for people that gave me names on Discord. But also, um, the first three episodes are up now. So I uh, I have like I, I haven't counted them. I haven't even written them on, on the list yet. But there's another like twenty to thirty names or something from people. I think most of those probably will never even see the light of day. Sorry, because um, I don't think we're gonna have that many people die. But hey, who knows? Maybe if shit goes really poorly wrong. Um, but yeah, for the moment, I still have enough names either way on the list. So. Uh, anyway, so yeah, I could hire some people, but I don't think I will right away. I do have some medals to give out as well, which I think I will do. Uh, first of all, we definitely have a badge of the survivalist with plus five defense winning cover, which I'm going to award to... Uh, oh, I already gave one to Lolo Deckers. Okay, I, I thought I hadn't done that yet. I only have one assault. Yeah, I need to give it to other assaults. I could give them to supports as well at this point, but... Eh. So I'm not going to. I also have the Medal of Mourning, which the first one was awarded to Lucy King, my support, right? So I think that's a good idea. I'm going to keep giving those to support. Uh, or no, I, I think I was giving them to whoever had the lowest um, wheel. I, I wanted to give it to supports, but I think I, gener I ended up giving it to the people with the lowest wheel. So let's have a look at that. Whoever has the lowest wheel. Also, I want to have a look at Lucy King. Uh, just quickly, I should all okay. French, right? There was also one sec. Chief, what language are you speaking? Oh, that's not the right thing. You're speaking German. See, why the fuck is she speaking German? I let's just go for English. <laughs> I re I remember, like think like yeah, that came up a couple times in my mind where I'm like, what what language is is she speaking? That doesn't fit her thingy I'm gonna go for all of them real quick to make sure I didn't make any other mistakes. French for Belgian, that's fine. They can speak Flemish or French. Yeah, all right, so that's all good. Anyway, right, so the lowest will. Uh, so Tami Tsunami actually has 56 will, which is pretty decent. Let's see if anyone else has super low. Yeah, so Lucy has just has 30, which is why I gave one to her. 42 for Toby, 37 for Andrea Spear, but she's still a rookie, so it's really kind of unfair. You know what, Tami is actually not up there with the highest, so let's, I'll keep, I'll keep giving to supports for now. I think that's fairly important too. So I'll award this one to Tsunami. There you go. Tsunami, your first medal. Wear it with pride. All right, so now that that's done, I want to build some buildings and I want to get some more satellites up or build some more satellites anyway. I am seven engineers away from being able to build, oops, the satellite uplink facility. I need 20, but I was looking around just now. I think it is definitely time to build a regular old workshop. Kind of sucks because it doesn't do anything except for giving five engineers and the adjacency bonus, which we don't get yet. Like I, I would prefer building something that actually does something, the cybernetics lab, the genetics lab, the foundry, but we kind of need those engineers because I think satellites are definitely one of the more important things to focus on in this game. So. I'm gonna begin construction of that here, and I'm probably gonna just allocate this area here for workshop, and then maybe over here or something for lab laboratories. I don't know yet. Either way, build a workshop, 130 bucks. We're gonna get a lot of money soon, so that's good. Oh, that was 26 bucks a month, but I think that's after we get our council report. Yeah, so that's just after, which is good. So we have to pay those 26 bucks right away, I guess, or maybe we do. I don't know if that's immediately happening. I don't know if this actually went up or not, or down. Um, and then I'm also gonna, I'm not, I, that's my money gone. I thought I had more money. I was gonna say, I'm gonna build some satellites as well, but now I'm not doing anything of the sort. Uh, do I have anything that can be sold yet? No. Even these things, they don't say like, there's no research to be done, but they also don't say you can just sell them. So you need them for something. Uh, these actually do say they're being researched now, which for some reason it didn't do last time. 
Um, we are working on beam weapons, so we might actually get a different weapon or something. Let's scan and see what that. There we go. Uh, I've also been told now in one of the episodes a lot of people gave tips and stuff or for stuff that I already figured out by just playing further because again I recorded six episodes before even uploading the first one but uh, yeah laser rifle that's good so what people did say is that if you um, which I didn't know all right it's just yeah we're gonna look at this in a second if you um, stun someone with the stun gun thingamajig uh, then the weapon doesn't explode which I'm assuming that means you can get more research for those weapons or something like that. I'm not entirely sure. That's just kind of a guess, really, to be honest. Anyway, uh, right, so we got this autopsy still ready. I was thinking, though, we are going to get... Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Uh, I guess, which one is Additional it? It's the... D we have ways, right? Yeah, we have ways. That makes... Research instant or it makes it interrogations instantly. I wonder if it's worth going for that But eh, 50 and 80 bucks is not really the highest amount of money. Probably not. But having said that I still don't think I want to Go for these autopsies right now. I'm not sure. Maybe I should. They're very quick But getting some different types of weapons. This is the from the looks uh, from the looks of things. This is a sniper and the um, heavy thing but then we also have the heavy laser, so maybe this is the rocket launcher, and then heavy laser is the actual heavy weapon. I think that's probably what it is. I think going for this precision laser is definitely worth doing right now. And then I'm assuming we can now build our laser rifle and laser pistol. Nah, we can actually already build two of no, one of these. Damn, we're just shy of being able to get two of them. Definitely going to manufacture one of them. Instantly? Yeah, immediate. Do I get a pistol as well? We're not really focused too much on pistols. They're not very expensive, but they do cost alloys as well. It's something to keep in mind. Um, how much is this, by the way? 14 alloys. Yeah, I definitely want to get one or two more of those, I think. But we'll hold off on that until we get the next mission, because we might get money before that, so I don't need to waste anything. Let's have a look at this actual weapon, because I haven't done that yet. So, this is uh, 2 to 4, 5 to 7, 10% crit chance. Oh, also, the range is short. I didn't realize that. I thought it would be medium. Ah, oh, well this one is medium, uh, 4 to 6, the other one was 2 to 4, 10% crit chance the same, 8 to 10 critical damage, so yeah, this is like, 2 to 4 goes to 4 to 6, and 5 to 7 goes to what, 6 to 10 was it? 8 to 10, it's just way better, and also medium range, yeah, we just need to, we definitely need to get a, a load of these when we go into our next mission, but, um, we're out of money basically, we're gonna get a lot of money when we get our, um, council report, but for now, Looks like they've changed their tactics. But why? Why do this? It's a message to the entire world that nothing can stop them. I like how you see people getting fucking slaughtered, and it's like some may some people may find this footage disturbing. You don't say. those things. Fuck, I remember them. <laughs> Please don't give us a mission immediately. Yeah, okay, I figured that was gonna happen. In Sydney, very difficult. Oh, fuck, great. That's awesome. Uh, alright. Well, oh my god, it instantly sets up free. Oh no, we haven't got our best sniper available. Shit, boss. Oh no, all of our good units are unavailable. Alright, let's go back to briefing for a second. So what's going on? Going on? We're missing... We're mi oh no, literally all three of... Okay, we're definitely have to bring Zhang on this one. But yeah, we're missing Chi... Uh, Goop. Uh, Chief is better. Although there is another Chief on the list as well, but that they're not in yet. Anyway, we're missing Chief, we're missing Tsunami, we're missing Cheesecake. So we're missing all three of our best operatives right there. The Captain and two Lieutenants. That's it. That's how we're gonna have to bring a Lieutenant and a bunch of squaddies on this one, probably. 
I don't even know if I want to bring any rookies in this one. Um, so that's great. Having said that, I need to have a look at what kind of weapons, because I... Oh god, it's all snipers. No, I'm gonna have to bring some... Oh, this is horrible. <sighs> can I bring you anyway? Like, you, you will have, like, two less health. I don't know if I can actually bring you, though. I don't know if it's worth... Well, it definitely would be for the rockets, I think. Especially against those chrysalid fucks, if I remember that's what their name is, anyway. I think we're gonna have to bring Jim Thompson or Andrea Spear. Aim 55, Andrea Spears 60. Alright, I'm probably gonna have to bring Andrea Spear with us here. Um, either way, let me figure this out. Well, no, before I do that, I'm definitely gonna buy at least one more of these guns, which are, I believe, I believe they were 24, right? So, we can sell one sectoid corpse. That will allow us to buy one more. If I have to spend, like, sell another five corpses to buy one more, I probably will, to be honest, because that is just incredibly good. Like, that upgrade of that gun is just insanely big. But it depends on how many people with those types of weapons I'm bringing, so let's figure that out, shall we? That's the wrong way to go. Alright, so let me just figure that out. I'll be back with you guys in a sec. Alright, I... Uh, I should have started in the other screen, but I'm gonna sell a bunch more items. I just want to do that on camera, so there's no uh, no crazy things happening here. But yeah, I want to sell. I guess it's gonna have to be more corpses. Do three of those, uh, four of those. All right, and I'm gonna buy one more weapon, and then I'll set up the rest on screen so you guys can see everything, because those things are just way too good. This is not. An optimal team by any means it's actually quite a crappy team I think but uh, this is the team as it stands I'm gonna give you a rifle a new rifle as well and I'm also gonna give you the nanofiber vest right so um, we're gonna have Zhang as our leader which just sucks because he's not one of the actual characters like he's not one of you guys which is just annoying which you could change the name but you can't um, we've got King we got Lolo Deckers we've got uh, Max Dragon, and we got Andrea Spear, who's supposed to be Andrew Spear, and then we have Toby Toby Wanklin. I had an op I had a choice between him and and um, Bjorn Hellgate, and they're both basically identical, so I just went with him. They did give out some different items though, so I've given her a rifle as well, so a laser rifle, because that's I think it's just better than the shotgun, especially if we're up against chrysalids who are fast moving. We don't want to be close to them because if we are, they just fuck us up. I think so. We have three of those things, which is pretty damn good. Also, this one looks like it's colored like her armor. That's weird. Um, oh, I guess it is, actually. That's cool. Right, this one's red as well. I just realized that. That's pretty cool. Anyway, so... As for items, all we have left is the scope, which I guess is going to go to... So, Max is aim 65. He's actually worst of Wanklin, isn't he? Um, yeah, he's 68. I don't know why I went into that screen. So, you know what? I'll, I will give this to, to you, then scope just to catch you up a little bit and then Wanklin the sniper is gonna get a fucking frag grenade honestly snipers are probably not, not very good in this mission but <laughs> I need I, I only have fucking snipers available this is just terrible uh, anyway so we have plenty of grenades at least we have two rockets from him two grenades uh, flashbang grenade we have the support thing which fortunately He's not leveled up enough to even be able to use the, like, he doesn't have free things yet. At least we have six people on this mission, so that's something, I guess. And then, yeah, it's just, well, you can see what we have. This person's got actually a little bit of HP because the the thingy magic. Alright! Let's fucking do it! I really hope I didn't need to bring my stun gun on this one, because I probably could have. Maybe I should have anyway. Oh well. Too late now. We're flying. All the way to Sydney. Strike one. Prepare for Australia has sent a number of requests for Australia. assistance. So that's our next drop site. All right, is that going to be all you We've say again? We've reports oh. of alien activity taking place in a densely populated urban center. We should move to secure the area and minimize further civilian casualties. All right, Operation Cryptic Priest. Approach civilians to un enable ex evacuations. Minimal, minimal, minimize. Minimize. Is that a word? I thought it was minimalized. No, minimalized sounds even dumber. Minimize civilian casualties. Never mind. And neutralize all hostile targets. Okay. When facing enemy long range and armed with a shotgun, consider switching to a pistol. That's very helpful. Thank you. I thought maybe it was going to give something helpful for this particular mission. Like last, well, not last time, a couple missions ago, he was saying something very specific about poison. I was like, oh, Finn then? Strike team is in position near the terror site. Awaiting confirmation. Solid copy, big sky. Strike one has been given the green light. 
Your highest priority is to protect those civilians. All right. Well, there's some nice high ground here. Unfortunately, again, snipers, our snipers don't have squad side because they're kind of crap. Um, but probably still worth going up there, especially because there is a civilian there anyway. I think we'll start by moving Zhang up here, just because he's the only one who can get there. Although, unfortunately, he's the one with the rocket, so I'd rather not move him first, but I'm still going to do it, just so I can maybe discover... Contact. Oh, God. Oh, it's those guys. Okay. Fuck me, they're angry. There's a guy in there as well. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no, and he gets a fucking running... Oh, my God, he's right there. Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> oh... Gosh, darn it. This is really bad. Turn one. Lucy, what's your shot from here? Oh, you haven't got one. Really? That one's just not quite sure. Um, Alright, so these guys are dangerous. Well, these guys are much more dangerous. What's your chance to just fuck one up right now? Tell me this is better. 97%, okay. That said, you've got the best shot on that guy right there, so... These guys, they, I think they can move quite far. It looks like this guy might be going for the kill on the civilian, which I think might be okay for us in this case. I do believe, I mean, the more civilians you save, the better. I do believe there's rewards attached to that. Um, having said that, not having operatives die. Pretty important, too. I'm not going to lie. But yeah, we don't have to take cover from those guys, because they they're melee. But these guys, we do. And unfortunately, we fucking grab two enemies at once. You can't move and shoot, so you have to basically shoot from here. But if you do and you don't kill... Then you're just gonna get fuck. You're just dead. So I think we gotta move everyone else first, see what they can do, and then take the chances last with the snipers. I.e., maybe not having to take any chances. You go in here. You should be okay. I don't know if you can actually shoot anything around there. Probably not from here. Maybe from there. But I, I mean, I only have so many people I can move here. Um, you can already shoot that guy. Lolo Deckers, you suck. I gave Lolo Deckers a, uh, I, I've already said that, I think. Ooh, I could maybe chuck, no, there's definitely no way I can hit both of those anyway. Um, yeah, I did say I, I gave her a, uh, a regular rifle rather than a shotgun, because I figured with these fucking guys we don't want to be up close, but I think I already explained all that. Alright, so the only three people we really have got to move are you, so I don't know if I can move here and still shoot. I feel like maybe I should be able to, but I don't know for sure. Um, so I could go here, there, with you. It's half cover from them, but maybe here then instead. That's probably safer. And then going here would be the other option. So let's do Lucy first. Alright. That's a 50. I think we're just going to take the 71 on this one, to be honest. I could do a smoke as well. That might actually be really useful in this case. So I guess we're going to hold off on that one for now. Position You're going to go right there. 65. That's all you've got. Well, you may as well take that one, then. For fuck's sake. Really, really can't afford misses like that right now. Can you have a shot from there? It'd be really good if you could. Unfortunately, you can't. Son of a bitch. Oh, God. Um, oh, ye gods. My roast is ruined. I feel like you're just going to have to take that shot. You've got one of the chrysalids. We have an almost guaranteed shot with you, so that's fine. I guess we should take that. Yeah, but you can, you can kill that one. Yeah, but we need to kill this chrysalid, though. If we don't kill this chrysalid, we're fucked. So we definitely take out the chrysalid first. So that's going to be you. With a 97. 0% chance of crit. Fuck, I was hoping for maybe a crit. So that's just basic. Well, let's just see how much it is, I guess. A oh, hollow targeting. Fuck, I forgot about that. Only 4 damage, though. Okay, so you could actually do 77 on that one now. I guess you also have an 81 now on that one. Yeah, that's definitely what we're going to take. Up to 60. Well, but you could do the smoke grenade. Uh, I should have done that holo targeting first before I shot with Deckers. That might have made a difference right there. you got a 60. Okay, let's just take this. I'm not going to go for the crit. Don't fucking let me down. That's a massive miss. What was that? Negative damage. Yeah. No fucking shit on the negative damage there, buddy. Jesus. Alright, just take this. You got it. Alright, that's a kill. Which means we got two people left, one of which can't do shit. The other one can kill this thing, but then there's still that one there. And then we can't throw a smoke grenade. So, one of the snipers legitimately might be dead. 
You're flying thing, so it takes your entire turn up. Wait, what? Oh, is he fucking scared? Oh, there goes the civilian. Oh my god. That's just a little show of what it can do to us. Is he gonna be able to move afterwards? No. Alright, that one's fucked off because I killed his friend. Well, that's actually very convenient. You have a shuttle, not one there. I wonder why he didn't last turn. Interesting. Alright, so we lost a civilian, but certainly things could be far, far, far worse. So I'm not gonna complain. I'd love to get up on the roof, but it definitely doesn't look like that's gonna be able to happen this turn. I was gonna say I should have considered that last turn, but there's no fucking way I could do anything about that last turn. I think it's time we either just sit here and overwatch, which risks losing more civilians, but it makes it so that one is probably dead before he can do anything. Or we just start moving up and then overwatch, I guess. You can get up on the roof. Oh, you can get up on the roof right here. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Oh, and actually save one right away. Yeah, you're definitely going to do that. Please no chrysalis on the roof. Please, game. <laughs> Don't do this to me right now. I mean, we discovered two groups of enemies right away, so the chance of discovering many more is pretty... Well, I mean, we'll discover more, but not like an insane amount right away. That's a pretty decent shot, plus you got holo targeting, so... Free damage only, fucking hell. That's disappointing, I'm not gonna lie. You can get up on the roof as well, but you don't really want to be on... Yeah, that's a terrible movement anyway. You don't really want to be on the roof anyway, so... You go right there, I don't know if I've got a shot from there, but... I do. 63. Ugh, that's with holo targeting, jeez. This is, we gotta remember, there's still that guy back there as well who could try and flank us or something. Like, if we just run you up here? God, if that guy from there just, like, jumps up and we, like, we're not in cover, he just gets a free critical hit. That's kind of risky. I think I'm just gonna put you guys down here, so next turn I move you up. Double time. And next turn you get up where you need to be. So we'll get you up here as well. Just right there, why not? Naruto. Decision Naruto. Something, something, Naruto. Lolo Deckers. Again, we could easily get flanked from here. Uh, I could run and gun with you. I'm going to watch. Then again, if I run and gun... Yeah, I was planning on running and gun here. If the enemy then runs like that... Well, we probably still got Overwatch. But well, you might just want to take your shot anyway. 63. It's not great. But an Overwatch shot will be not great either, to be honest. Maybe I run you guys this... Or start moving you guys this way. That's affirmative. You got a shot from there, but your shots are too... Eh, 59, it's not bad. Um, see, I don't dare putting them here. Because of that thing that's over there somewhere. It can't be that far away. Um, little Uruk. King, take that 63. Fuck. Deckers. Mm, pas ça du tout. Don't let me down, please. Uh, Affirmative. Come on, come on! What is that? Well, someone's dead. Oh, and that one turns into a zombie as well. That's great. They don't move very far, if I remember correctly, but someone's gonna get fucked. Oh, no, he's going after the civilian. Well, we got saved again, but no thanks to fucking our team. Holy shit. There's a couple of civilians up there. Is he gonna get an attack steal? No, that's good. All right, that one's not gonna be able to reach us, I'm pretty sure, but we're gonna be stuck killing that, this thing for now. <sighs> what do we miss there? A 63, a 50-something, and a... God, I lost two civilians already. This is great. 100% chance to fuck one up with a critical as well. I'd love to reload you first, but... Um... I mean, yeah, this is too good not to do, isn't it? Six damage on the My crit. Gun is empty. God damn. Can some people do some fucking more work here, please? Uh, snipers need to get up on the roof right now. If I move you any further, it's... Like, if I risk finding out more enemies... These snipers, man, they suck so much for this mission. They're just, they're basically useless. I think I'm just gonna use their shots right now instead, actually. All right, that's a kill from Max. Can you get a level up on that, please? If you can get squad side, you're instantly way better. Did no level up, though. Son of a gun. Um, all right, we need to start walk, like running off to these fucking civilians here. 
I affirmative. I affirmative. Did you just say that? God damn it. I also just realized he's the sniper. As I moved him, I was like, wait a second. I've got a grenade though. I could chuck a nade at this guy. And honestly, gets rid of his cover. Might not be a terrible idea. Let's move other people first. So, King. You should have a shot from there. Not from there though. There, definitely. Zombie is dead. Little Deckers. Civilians here too. There, I mean, there's civilians all over the fucking place. There's definitely some on the roof still as well, so I gotta deal with them too. You know what? Yeah, you're just gonna chuck a nade. Okay, we don't need these nades for anything else, so... Can you get a crit crit weight on the nade? That'd be great. Great nade. There's still another one of those twats around there as well, by the well. By, by the well? By the way. Oh, that's pretty good right there. Full cover. Don't mind if I do 63. God, King, I thought you were better than this. What is your aim? 63. Oh, never mind. That's pretty crap. Wait, is, is that just saying how much a chance I have right now of hitting this guy? Either way, take your crappy shots and miss again. All right, never mind. Finally. That's a level up for King. That's good. That's very good. Molto bene. That's what they uh, would say in Africa. Um, Andrea Spear. I think it's time for you to start rescuing some civvies. Again, I can't move up too far. We have to scout three groups of enemies already. Although, again, this mission, it's very difficult apparently. Plus, there's like 18 civilians across the entire map. I never even looked at the map, by the way. Oh, it's not very big. So, yeah, it's not very big at all, actually. Uh, there's still that fucking twat as well. I, can't, I just can't remember that. We missed three shots on that thing. I'm not... I will risk it. Shoot. Don't discover enemies. Don't, 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 don't. Thank you, Andrea. That means Lolo can move up as well. Unless I really want to take care of that one, but the chance of doing so is pretty slim. So why don't we move you Moving up here? Position. And get you reloaded. Just as someone's fucking reloaded for the day. No, not Overwatch. Reloaded. Alright, he's gonna kill that civvy, but that's okay. Hello. Like, is it every time that one kills something, it turns into a fucking zombie? That one's gonna do his... Okay, he's gonna kill Sivvy as well. Well, we are gonna... <laughs> We're not gonna save many civ civilians over here. Uh, you could shoot a rocket. Can I hit both of those? That might actually be... Worth doing, but no, I can't. I can kill that one, though. Which will kill... Which will save a Sivvy as well. Probably is worth doing. <laughs> Watch there be another civilian right there that I just can't quite see. Yeah, you know what? I will kill this thing with a fucking rocket. Watch him miss now. Rockets away. Okay. Fuck, can I still get up here to save that civilian? <laughs> Fucking hope I can. Alright, King, I'd love to reload with you. Uh, what's your chance on this guy? 23, not very good. Why don't we move you up and reload? Please don't discover more enemies. Thank you. Actually, what's your chance? You haven't even got a shot. Never mind, reload. Max, you haven't got a shot either. Time to get up on the roof. You could get very much critted from there, which is a bit risky. If I go there, I'm definitely discovering more enemies. If I go here, I could help out around here, but it's, there's no enemies there, so I don't think that's relevant. I think I put you in the corner here. Very risky, <clears throat> but at least you're in position for next turn, if you don't die. So just don't die, Max. Maximilian, just don't die. That's all I ask of you. Uh, is uh, I wonder if this guy's going to turn into a fucking... Zombie. I really hope he doesn't because. Rip if he does for those two civilians there. Uh, who are you? Lolo. Right, Lolo, you're on your way to save these civvies around here. So, first of all, let's get this one done. There's three more people in there I can already see. There's one up here as well, but we have people up here who can do that. God, again, putting you in a corner here. If we discover enemies, it's so risky. But we have to keep moving as well. This is one of those missions where it's, it's a bit awkward. Wanklin with sniper. Nope, that's not a good shot at all. Uh, Lolo Deckers is going to run up here as well. Not up here. Although that's two more civvies. We really ought to send someone up there. So you, Wanklin, are supposed to be up here. So maybe you should be running this way. To deal, to get these civvies. Then again, we 
have some people up here. I guess we could have Zhang do that instead, although Zhang's pretty fucking important to us. I think you're gonna just go on Overwatch here. Or just our... No, I think I do run you up here for next turn, right? Ooh, that's running that way first, which is very likely to discover more enemies. Again, there's still one of those things around here somewhere, probably killing civilians, to be honest, but... Um... Nah, fuck it. I'm running you over here. Am I? No, I'm not. Nah, I'll just leave you here. Fuck it. Go on Overwatch. It's a long fucking decision uh, making process there. You can't get in at any good cover if I could get step one fuck one fucking tile. That's all I needed from you. Um. Yeah, that position's taken. Let's go out. here. All right. I need to start rescuing some civvies. He's gonna kill another civilian. Did he miss? No, he didn't miss. <laughs> As it turns out. Oh, that was it. Okay. What is your shot? 57. Max. That's not bad, Max. I mean, you're gonna fail, because I know you, Max, but that one didn't turn into an enemy. That's great. Now, do I... I think I move half and reload. I will take care of it. And then you're gonna be able to capture, rescue those people there soon, and then even provide some support up there, maybe. Let me reload. Let me reload. You haven't got a shot. That is just fucking weird to me. Go over there and maybe have a decent shot. Do we just take this one first? 57. Maximilian. Take the, take the headshot. Why not? If you do hit... Ooh, that looks like it might be on. No, it wasn't on. It was very much off, in fact. Okay. Time to rescue some civvies. I can rescue this one right here. Get the fuck out of here, bitch. Hurry. Something along those lines. Uh, you can run... Right Rolling there. Out. Rolling out. I gotcha. Go. Okay. We're catching up to the saviors. Oh fuck, what's this? What are you, are you doing something? What? What was that? J'y vais tout de suite. Too sweet. Not quite in range of that one, unfortunately. Your shot on this guy is still fucking rank, so overwatching was completely useless. He might keep shooting people in there. I can't see who else is in there, but he might just keep shooting them anyway, so... Might want to move you, but... If I move you, I want to move you fully, because you can't shoot with your sniper anyway. So yeah, I'm gonna move you up here. Oh, fuck, yeah, that was that. I'm running outside, though. No enemies, no enemies. Okay, okay. Oh, god, more vision. Nope, no more enemies. Nice one, Tobly. To Tobster. Toblerone. Um... Do I have a smoke this turn? Yeah. Yeah, well, this might be a good turn to chuck some smoke. Smoke out, boys. Can't hit all three of them, so let's hit the two snipers. Sniper bros. Can't hit myself. But I think she'll be alright. Whoa, she threw it through the fucking floor. Impressive. Oh, here's that twat. Oh, God. What's he doing? Oh, that was his move. Oh, that was his move as well, right? That takes a full turn? No, it doesn't. Oh, my God! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what was so funny. He got blown off the fucking roof. See you later, bitch. <laughs> Holy shit. Alright. The two sniper rune Renos. Oh, well, you've got a decent shot on that one, actually. 57. Max, are you gonna let me down? I don't think you will. You gotta reload after this, though, so... You better not. Nice! Maximilian, doing work today. Is that a level up for Max? Still not. Son of a fucking bitch. Alright, you're probably gonna rescue this one so that she can move elsewhere. Uh, you could possibly run and gun and do something as well. Ooh, there's a person right there we can rescue as well. Can you get up? No, you can't. Maybe you should get rid of this person. If you go right there, then this person runs away. She might get more movement because she doesn't have to run around the civilian. No, that made literally no difference. <laughs> Never mind. Um, oh, you can't get here anymore. Fuck, I messed that up. I messed that up quite, quite, quite poorly. That's still gonna rescue one of them at least. Get out of here. Wait, did it not? Because the fucking door's closed. Hold on. You're kidding me right now. Can I, can I run and gun and open the door? Is that something that works? If this one dies now, I'll be really annoyed because we, we're right. Can you open the door still? No. That's so dumb. Okay, right. Um, no, you, 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 
You. There we go. Wanklin. Take this crunk, would you? 68. Don't let me down, Wanklin. Looks good. Ah, I mean... Damn it, Wanklin. Actually. Could you fucking just get better? Get good, Wanklin. Can I chuck a nade on that one? Maybe. Um... There's two more civilians to rescue up here, but if I kill this guy, I On definitely rescue more of them. Should be able to chuck a nade from here at the very least if I don't want to take the shot. Shooting is definitely better. Can I chuck a... Oh, I can. Yeah, I saw red for a second. Yeah, there we go. No civilians right down there, right? Hope not. I'll take the guaranteed kill, because that way... That way he definitely can't kill the people up here. It, oh shit, that's it. Oh, nice. That was the last one. Well. Well, <laughs> well, well, that went alright, didn't it? I don't think any, anyone even took damage. We got very lucky, to be fair. On round one, we killed one of those flying things, which made the other one scare off. Which was the guy we just finished in the end there. That was the last, last one. And then... The second turn, that chrysalid, instead of running for us and killing one of us guaranteed, he actually ran the other way and uh, went for a civilian. Thank fuck for that. So that was actually not too bad. That went okay. We rescued two thirds of the civilians. I don't think I could have asked for more, to be honest. I did not realize that was the last enemy. I definitely thought there was going to be one more group around there, but oh, thank fuck, because that was our B team and a half. I was C that was our C team, right? There. Well, I mean, it, it had most of our <laughs> best like characters. Really oh, two more corporals and a squaddy. And Assault, yes. So much as a scratch. I mean, another heavy would be okay as well, but we have Zhang, which, again, I don't really want to use Zhang, but, eh, he's there, so, may as well. Um, but yeah, Andrea getting a level up, despite not killing anything. And we have another Sniper level up, and Lucy level up. That, that's, yeah, definitely some of the better level ups right there. So, starting with Run and Gun, cool, so I gotta switch her gear up, that's Andrew right there. Um, then we have Max, who's going to get Squad Sight, which makes him actually useful. And he's also got 74 aim now, plus 10, so 84. Uh, that plus 10 is afterwards, right? So it's not already... It's not It's not 64 plus 10. I think that's 84 right now. Well, 74 for his, himself. So yeah, leveling up once makes him just way better already. And then Lucy, also 68 aim, not too terrible. And oh, right, she got Sprinter first. That's still good, but I, yeah, I thought we were... Fuck me, how are you? How many? You've been on five missions. How are you this level? <laughs> I don't think you've been on like m many fewer missions than Tsunami has been. The Council Medal of Honor is now unlocked. Ooh, another medal. And we got another badge of the Survivalist and Cross of Cooperation. Chrysalid Autopsy and a bunch of corpses and shit. Panic in Australia decreased by two. Panic has decreased across Asia entirely. That's Remember, nice. We That's our entire. Yeah, so I'm sure the troops will be eager to get Unfortunately, that doesn't mean I want to get the bonus from this place so by putting one in China, but China's currently at lit literally zero, so there's not really any reason. We are going to lose Mexico though, which is a bit shit, but oh well. Um we have one Buccarino. Nice. So let's have a look at the new medal. Oh, we can't hire so Oh, cuz I've got no money. <laughs> the Council Medal of Honor. What does this do? Plus one aim and will for each mission completed with no soldier deaths up to a maximum of plus 10. Oh, that's definitely been like everything except for one. Or plus 10 aim and critical chance if not within seven tiles of an allied unit. Okay, so that's insane for any sniper. This is... This is probably almost at plus 10 already, isn't it? Unless it means for that soldier specifically? Oh god, I don't know exactly how that works. Either way, this is a very good medal. This is just, I mean, Will's not that important. Critical Chance is not that important either, though. But this is, like, just straight up really good for snipers immediately. This is probably really good for just about anyone. But only after a while. But, I mean, how many missions have we had that we haven't had kills? We've had two missions where someone died. And the rest have all been good. And we've had, like, two missions on average per episode, I think. Some of them had three, one of them had one. So, and this is episode seven. So, I think we've definitely had... About 10, maybe 9 or 8, but... Oh, missions with no kills, with no deaths anyway. So I feel like this is already plus 10 aim as well. Plus 10 will... Is that better than... Plus 10 critical chance? I don't think it is. I think this is just better in general, right? Just give it this one. Well, I'll... I guess I can hold off for now. Let's hold off for now. I'm gonna read up on it first. Um, just to see how everything works. 
We have uh, Andrea Spear is now an assault, so she's gonna get some new gear. Let me check my other assault gear. I had a heavy one. So customize you to number two and number six. I still might change this at some point. Someone also suggested you could do it by country, but I don't really value the country in this game right now because basically everyone who made like uh, all the characters that I have so far, I know where the people are from. For example, uh, Austria. Well, he's actually from Poland, so this one makes sense. Uh, actually, that one I don't know. Toby is from the UK. Bjorn is from Denmark. Andreas Andrew is from America. Jim, I actually don't know either. Chief is American. He is also Indian, though. Technics off Indian, so that one makes sense. Tsunami is from Latvia. So either way, almost, more than half the countries right now already, I know where people are from, and I don't have the right country, so I don't really t put any value on that. I want it to be from like where the people are actually from, but I can't do that because I can't change the country in this game. So anyway, um, so I don't, I can't, I can't do anything with that. That's what I'm trying to say. Let's uh, keep going. I want to get to my council report. Oh god, oh Jesus Christ. Okay. Fucking hell, stop. There were so many things that just happened. Um, I don't think there's anything I need to do though with any of that, so I guess we can just keep going. Gonna lose Mexico. Is there anything I can do about that? We can't launch. No, there's just, no, literally zero. Well, what about the. Our worst suspicions may have been true uh, after six all. Days still, yeah. They're not just here for abductions, they have something else in mind. What am I going to get again, currently? Satellite uplink I'm going to get three engineers, right. So, we actually are, once I get my workshop up, we're going to have enough for the next couple of satellites. So, I need to start working on satellites and the satellite uplink. But again, I can't afford that right now, so we to wait for the council reports. Commander, we've just lost the support of another council member. I know, man. I'm sorry. We don't care about America, North America specifically. Excellent work, Commander. <laughs> Excellent work. This council is pleased to see our continued support of this project has been worthwhile. We hope that your current successes only mark the beginning of an enduring effort to eliminate the extraterrestrial threat. I mean, to be fair, if you look at this, if you, if you exclude the fact that we lost uh, a country, it actually looks pretty good. The highest we have is free, and we only have four of those on free. The rest is all two and one. And again, playing on classic difficulty, so we start on a higher panic than you do on normal difficulty. I think on normal you start on one everywhere, so it's just very unlikely you lose anyone at any point. But yeah, things looking okay. Uh, we got a grade of a B. We Not bad. will be in touch, Commander. We will be in touch, Commander. So we have 565 bucks. So immediately, arrived this morning, Commander. Gonna set up. We're always glad to have more help down here. What else do we have again? I definitely want to just get like I think free Commander, probably. Our current satellite uplink facilities are at full Although, capacity. We should build additional uplinks as soon as possible to allow for new satellite I deployments. I might as well because there's no. I don't think there's a time. Like we're gonna be fine either way. So in, f in five days, the those satellites will be cheaper, and we will be able to build the facility. Now the satellites take 20, 20 days to get, so that'll be 25 days. We have 31 days until the next council report, so that's we still have six days left, and that doesn't, yeah. So I think we wait for the workshop to be done, because that saves us a bunch of money. And then we can also build the facility, which I will build here, and that will take 14, I can't see right now, but 14 days, I believe. So I think we'll be okay. Maybe it'll be cheaper because we have more engineers. I'm not sure how that works exactly. Either way, we also need money for the precision, precision lasers. So let's see if anything else pops up. Okay, Tsunami is back. That's good. Precision later, lasers. All right. So now we have the scatter laser and the laser sniper rifle. So I'm going to have a look at those for sure. I'll probably build some of them. Oh, this is the shotgun. Right. Yep, that's the shotgun. And then the laser sniper rifle. Definitely going to be building those as soon as possible. And then we got the heavy one as well. Still got plenty of other things, including all those autopsies. But, God, they're all free. Four and three days now. Jesus Christ. Now, let's get the heavy lasers first, and then we'll probably do all the autopsies. I just don't understand. Why use such advanced technology against innocent civilians? Why, indeed. Right, so now we have a shotgun and a sniper rifle, which I'm definitely going to be building... One of each, probably no more than one of each, maybe two snipers, because there might be a chance where I have two snipers like last mission, but generally not. Uh, but again, I may as well wait for the wait for the workshop, which will happen. Contact Fuck! Detected. Damn it! That's actually that's gonna cost me a little bit of money. Uh, we're definitely gonna send. Uh, okay, well, 
Right, so what's going to have to happen is we're going to have to build these things before I get the engineer thing, which means I get I have to pay a little bit more. I mean, it's only 25 bucks and 29 so it's not like I'm going to save myself a lot of money, but still, would it would have saved me a little bit. And that those couple of bucks have so far actually made a difference a couple times now. But yeah, if a workshop was done first, it would have been cheaper. And then I could have set everything else up right away as well. Now I have to remind myself next time, but that's okay. So I will be building a sniper and a scatter shotgun thingamajig, maybe one or two, depending on how many people we bring, but we'll see. For now though, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Until next time, have a good day and goodbye.